so uh, if it's you know it's alive <laughs> I'm gonna assume it's a girl because you're a girl and I assume that's genetic Am I going to be the big titty aunt who teaches her new swear words? <laughs> like a fairy godmother? Or, or like a wine aunt in a milfy way? Hmm? Are we going to go for the older Bobo? I was thinking I could MC the baby shower. I've already compiled a list of songs with the word baby in it. Obviously baby by beeps. <laughs> and then we could end it with baby got back. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking we could choreograph that. Like, ooh, baby, I want to get with you. Mm -hmm. It's really been fun, Marley. This is my life that could change forever. This can't be Marley tonight, okay? Okay, but like, who's gonna be? Parker's? Connor's? That guy from Giraffe Poor? <gasps> Rachel's! My dearest Marley, pray tell how could it be Rachel's? I, I get that Catholic school lacks in the sex ed department, but surely you, you understand that, well, when a man and a woman love each other very, very much, they do something together. Oh, it. no, no. <laughs> Ignorance is bliss, babe. I want to coast through simply blind to sex. <laughs> I'm kind of over it as a concept, but don't dodge my question. Whose is it? Okay, so you got a single mom it. I respect that. My offer still stands. <laughs> <laughs> I like sitting like this because my legs look so skinny. All the fat flows to my hips, and then suddenly, boom, model legs. <laughs> Ooh, I'm just a sexy lady with legs for days. <laughs> oh, this baby with me? No, no, I just take her for walk. My best friend, she's a single mom, a brave single mother, who just didn't accept her invitation to Lesbian University in time. <laughs> it would be Seth's. Who's Seth? He's a work friend, super nice guy, older. We went out for drinks a couple nights ago and we got acquainted, well acquainted. I was drunk, so I don't know if, you know, it wasn't weird or anything, but if there's something in here, it's his. Why didn't you tell me? I would have driven you home from the bar. I told you it wasn't weird, Marley. And I'm saying that it is weird to not remember if you wore protection, Liz. So now you're a sex expert. I know that that's not okay. That's not okay for someone to do to you. That's unfair. I'm sick of you accepting abuse from shithead dudes just because- Because what? What were you gonna say, Marley? And I'd think carefully before you spew off some stupid bullshit about something you know nothing about. You're not my parent, I'm an adult. Adult enough to have a fucking baby, Liz? You've never had to deal with this, Marley. You've never had to take a pregnancy test because no one ever wants to... I'm sorry. I don't want to hear where that's going. <sighs> Poor fucking Liz. How brave she is for being friends with Marley. Fuck you! I always thought that you felt some way about this shit, but I never thought you'd say it. <laughs> I dreamed that one day I would wake up and look like you and not have to look in a mirror and not have to overcompensate with this fake persona to make everybody else comfortable. But I'm over it. <laughs> I'm over it. <laughs> I'd rather be whatever thing you've made up in your head than some shallow, knocked out bitch. Mar. Are you really gonna blame me for how fucking obnoxious you are when we both know who's responsible? I will never be enough for you. Yet I'm entirely too much. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Mar. Mar, I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. You know, I love you. It's just that things are hard right now. Mar, you're the only person I have. You're my fucking anchor. I don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this fuck up baby. This fucked up fuck ups baby is not gonna help. So please, please come out here and help me. Mar, I love you, please. Mar, I'm sorry. I know it was cruel. I'm just, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Mar, can you give me a 
hug. Mark, can you open the fucking door? Mark, can you open the door? Can you open the door? Can you open the door? Marley, Marley. Marley, can you open the door? Marley, can you open the door?